Hey guys, you may have heard the division by zero is undefined. Let's look into this a little bit. Let's start with eight divided by two. Eight is equal to the sum of four twos. So eight divided by two is equal to four. This is one way you can think of division. So if we do eight divided by zero, we can take the eight and do zero plus zero plus zero plus zero. And we'll be able to do this forever. You might wonder, well, why don't we just call it infinity? Because it's going to be an infinite number of zeros. Why is it that we call it undefined? There's several other ways to look at it. Let me show you one. What is division? It is the inverse operation of multiplication. And this operation, an inverse operation, it happens a lot in math. Add and subtract. Square roots are the inverse of squares. And cube roots are the inverse of cubes. And logarithms are the inverse of exponentials. And there's so much more stuff that's an operation and an inverse. And inverses are cool. So if you start with five and do some of the various operations, you're going to get different answers. But what's cool, if we get rid of what we started with and then do the inverse of those operations, now bring us back to five. Well, at least these first four will. What does this do? If we do this zero divided by zero, does this bring us back to five? We we don't know that this would equal five. And in fact, even if we thought of division by zero as the same thing as multiplying by infinity, this still wouldn't bring us back to five. So that whole calling it infinity still doesn't fix the issue here. And the issue is all these other inverses bring us back to the original value, but division by zero does not. So what do you think? Should we call it undefined because of this?